All right, so uh, there was one groundhog that was living in my shed, under my shed. Now there's like eight of them, eight baby ones. And um, let's go check on them guys. They're probably digging in tunnels under my shed. We'll sneak up on them, see what they're up to. What's up guys? What's up guys? <laughs> you see them bastards probably digging a hole under all the tunnels under my shed. <laughs> oh wow. There was only one living underneath. Now it, there's like eight of them. But um, yeah, we're just gonna leave them alone. And let them enjoy their uh, life. Happy family up there. So we'll leave them alone. Alrighty, back to the video. So today we're gonna do another uh, modification to the car. Uh, something simple, something small, and something cool. So it's gonna be, uh, hold on, let the door open up. <laughs> Beautiful day today, nice. But what I was saying, uh, it's gonna be a small um, installation, nothing big, not a very difficult, but yeah. Uh, trying to remember where I put that box because I, have, I really have a lot of stuff all over the place in the garage, all the parts. So I need to remember where I put everything because uh, I don't know where I put that part. Uh-huh, I found it. Right here. <laughs> After searching for like 15 minutes, I got it. So what we're gonna be doing today is installing uh, door seal uh, protectors right up here. Because this gets a lot scratched out when going in and out. Um, it looks crappy, especially on a black, co black car. So that's what we're gonna be doing. And it gives a good look, especially for the car show. Uh, so yeah, let's, uh, let's install them. All right, let's open up the box. I mean, I already opened up to see, make sure everything inside, but I didn't really open the uh, <clears throat> package itself. So I got this at the um, AmericanMuscle.com. Uh, I'll tell you what, it wasn't, it wasn't cheap at all. Uh, uh, let me get a knife. This, this was pretty pricey. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, man, they packed these things pretty damn good. Here's one, and uh, here's another one. Let's peel this up for you guys. Oh yes. And you can see the quality of this is very nice. Before I put it up on my cars, uh, my pre previous car. It was um, like a vinyl sticker type thing. And after years, it was uh, it was peeling off at the edges. So it was just crap. So that's why I went with, went with this. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of the chrome. It has a little bit chrome, but it has all the, it has a carbon fiber accent, which you'll see down in the road. I'll be having some uh, trim and with a little bit of um, carbon inside, so that's why I went with this. But the quality of this is amazing. Uh, no wonder it was costing that much. So uh, yeah, let's pull the car out. That way we could see what we're doing and uh, put them on. Man, she sounds good. I, I just, 
She sounds good, but would sound even better with a full exhaust. And uh, I cannot wait for that to come. Uh, probably not gonna be this year, but next year for sure. <clears throat> so as you could see, it looks kind of bland right now, you know. Uh, so uh, when we add that door seal protector, it, look, it will look amazing. Yeah, yeah. A lot of times I see so many scratches back here going in and out. So that will protect definitely a lot, and uh, it will look awesome for car shows. All right, let's clean up the area. The way it doesn't have no debris or any kind of dust on the way, and it will stick very tightly and nicely all righty all righty let's put them on <coughs> and this is specifically made for the challengers the lengthwise so it's perfect spot where it is and it's gonna go like this <laughs> oh man that looks absolutely awesome perfect perfect add for the car and um, it's a perfect length because uh, the spot to put it on it just you can't miss it because the plastic trim ends right here and right here and it's a perfect match with the door seal protector so that's where we are gonna put it on all right man it looks awesome just look at that all right let's peel the 3m sticker in the back All right, let's give another good wipe. And uh, let's put them on. Line up perfectly with the this plastic trim. And just like that. I'm just gonna hold it here for like a minute <laughs> make sure it's uh very tight that's what she said <laughs> all right so it's all installed oh looks good all right then we're gonna repeat the same process on the other side Hey yeah, guys, if you are new to the channel, uh, pl uh, please subscribe my channel. Um, help me out a little bit. Man, this sticker doesn't want to peel out. But yeah, if you guys could subscribe my channel, uh, click that bell and not to miss any upcoming videos. I'd appreciate it so much. Just trying to grow my channel a little bit and uh, um, show you all cool stuff on this channel with modification and other stuff all right look at that that's a ladybug here get out of here Boop. all righty boys it's all installed nice carbon fiber uh piece for the car and it looks absolutely awesome i love it i love it it looks more like um more professional look uh let's check out the other side might as well <clears throat> oh yeah baby I love it it is nice extra add on on a car and the reason I went with the Challenger logo because there's some people that sees me hey Sergio how you been how's your charger and I'm like man I don't have no charger I have a Challenger so <laughs> there is still people out there that doesn't know difference between Charger and a Challenger so for those of you who doesn't know the difference let me show it to you square body okay okay two two circular headlights on each side this is a challenger this is not a charger and it has only one door not four doors <laughs> so now that people could come up at the car show and take a look inside and they see 
Challenger logo. Oh wow, this is a Challenger. Yeah, it's not a Charger. <laughs> so that's why I went with a Challenger. And I could have choose a Hellcat, but I just went with that one. Anyways, guys, thank you for tuning in with me with this episode. It was a small little uh, modification for the car, but it makes cool difference. Stay tuned for upcoming more videos because we're going to do a lot, a lot of modifications. And I absolutely cannot wait. So uh, for right now, guys, I'm out and uh, I'm going to go eat some breakfast. But you don't forget to click that button, like, give me a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll catch you for the next one. God bless you guys. Bam.